Hello everyone, this is Johnny Hunt. Uh, thanks for checking out the Chord Melody U channel here on YouTube. It's Christmas time. Christmas time is a coming. And so uh, I've been thinking about like for two, three months now, uh, uh, throwing some more Christmas songs on here. I think I only have like four or five. So, you know, it's a little uh, late in this Christmas season because it's like a week from Christmas as I sit here making this video. But, uh, you know, so it goes. Um, so another familiar standard secular song. It was uh, first released in 1957. And if you can name the artist who originally recorded it, uh, you are definitely a Christmas trivia buff. Uh, his name was Bobby Helms. And yes, I did look it up on Wikipedia because I didn't know either. So uh, it's Jingle Bells Rock and we're gonna go through and play it. Uh, I'll go ahead and uh, just play it the way I do and then we'll uh, do the lesson part where we talk about all the fingerings and chords and uh, how you can learn to play it as well. So again, I play it in the key of C, a nice, nice uh, open key. It's got some uh, familiar chords and some that might be a little bit uh, new, but you know, if, if we want to play Frere Jaca all day long, then uh, we're not really going to learn very much. So um, I, uh, I urge you to just kind of uh, work through the rough spots till you uh, get them worked out and you can play them. And uh, have a good time while you're uh, enjoying the journey. So Jingle Bell Rock. <laughs> So um, that's roughly how you play it. And as we uh, go through and explain the mistakes, uh, I'll show you what you should really be doing. So um, again, it's in the key of C. We're just playing our regular 0003, our favorite uh, major chord. So first, second, third, fourth string, third fret, second fret, open, second open, Zero, 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 third string open. Fourth string open, second open. Third, fourth open. Uh, D minor. Uh, just strumming through. Two, two, one open. Second fret. Open four string. So back to D minor, two, two, one. So second fret, second string, third string open, third string first fret, G chord. You can do it this way, I like to use my pinky. 
So it says 4, 2, 3, or open 2, 3. I got my finger here, but I'm not using the fourth string at this point. So third string, third fret, back to D minor. Second string, second fret. Open third string, first fret of the third string, back to G. Back to D minor. So two, 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 one, full chord. Melodies here on the E string open. And then this is a G chord with a sharp five, which makes it an uh, augmented chord. Even if you just play that note by itself, it's okay. But make sure you get that note because it, it creates the tension that you're going to resolve on the downbeat of the next phrase, which is back to the back to the head here. So, so zero 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 C chord, third fret, second fret, top string, open second, open third fret of the third string. Open, I'm sorry, open third string. So here, let's talk about uh, each each note. Third, third, second, 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 open, second, open, open third, third fret of the third, I'm sorry, open fourth string. Second, open third, third fret of the third string, and then an A chord, two, one, zero, zero, melodies on the top string open, fourth string open fret, and then we're just moving over from A to C, so instead of two, one, zero, zero, it's two, zero, one, zero. So uh, melodies on the fourth string, two, zero, one, zero, third, third, fifth, fifth, third, third, and then we're going to uh, the F minor, which is five, five, four, three. Third string, third fret of the fourth string, fifth, third, uh, a D seventh, two, 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 three. So third fret of the top string, open, G chord, two, I'm sorry, zero, two, three, two, and all the melodies on the top string, second, third, fifth, and when you're going out, just doing the same thing again, the D7, two, 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 three, Open four string G chord, second, third, fifth fret, and then one more time. Back to D seventh, two, 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 three. Third fret, open, G chord. You can do G seventh too, it doesn't matter. Second, third, fifth fret of the E string. You can do this pull off if you want, but it just ends here. The third. And that is Jingle Bell Rock. Uh, it came out kind of around the time of At the Hop, you know, the rock, rock and roll song. So you have like a jingle hop instead of just, you know, the Danny and the Juniors hop. And it is also sort of a takeoff on Jingle Bell. So it's a, it's a hybrid, and uh, but it stands on its own as a good Christmas song to learn. So uh, if you need to uh, ask me a question, please do that by email. Uh, send a note to chordmelodyuke at yahoo.com, and I'll try to uh, get your sleigh back on the, the tracks there if you, uh, you end up in the ditch. So again, Merry Christmas from uh, Johnny here at Chord Melody Uke, and I'll look forward to um, teaching you another lesson here soon. Thank you.